Hi there guys and welcome back to some more Thor God of Thunder as a part of my Marvel Monday series. We're about to get into chapter 8, so let's get into it. Fuck's sake. I'll fight you again. Jesus. like like the finishing moves of Thor but I just don't like the gameplay very much everything seems to be very repetitive we've done pretty much the same thing on Niflheim and now Vanaheim we're doing the same thing so well obviously we're going to finish the game it's a Marvel game but uh, yeah Definitely not enjoying this as much as uh, as I did Spider-Man. Spider-Man, you could say, was pretty much the same as well, but at least it was different mechanics for each enemy that you had to fight. Okay, well, as everyone did there. Okay. You got too close, lizard. Sorry. There we go. earth am I meant to do there? Is that what I was meant to do the whole time? Ah. Well, I mean, at least I got past that part. 
That's fine, because it's an elevator. to wage war against Asgard, and for that Odin has summoned terrible retribution, a monstrous entity called Mangal that consumes living souls. Frostgrinder was to deliver our armies to Asgard, but instead delivered this foul and monstrous thing, bound in molten chains that quickly fell away and returned to Asgard. We cannot control it. None of our weapons has any effect. Mangog is destroying us. None of my kind may survive to hear this, but before the beast was freed, we detected the god mineral Skabrite in its chains. Perhaps Skabrite holds some power over the creature. For the sake of my people, we may only hope. If you are hearing this, Skabrite may be the only hope not just of the Vanir, but of the whole world tree. Mangar must be stopped. Well then, that is who we're going to go find, I guess. Who's that Ulic guy? You! Impossible! Ulic! Be still or I will crush like you to dust! Crossgrinder must see me home! Ulic, wait. There's been a change of plan. You must let Thor use Frostgrinder. I need him back in Asgard. Then, I'll send you to Nornheim. The deal, trickster. Ulick will not fall for your deceits. No one knew that's Frostkinder before I do. Kill him! Okay. Unleash the war beast, excellent. Fuck's sake. What is this? More of the same shit.
powerful. Come to me, Odin son. We will settle this. It's about time, Ulik. You're going to be just the same, aren't you? you just feed it. And just get you to fall onto one of those. You just stay on Ulrich is stunned, okay. Oh, okay. Take that, you bitch. Fuck 
Oh. So it's left trigger. That's going to be it. That's going to be left trigger again. Going to be X again? It is. And that's bullet dead. Well, I say dead. Down. <laughs> Standard thought. Throwing people through walls. Loki, where have you been? What is the state of Asgard? The situation is grim. Mangog has opened portals for our enemies to invade. I fear even Odin is no match for the creature, weakened as he is from the Odin sleep. The Odin sleep? Why was father in the Odin sleep? Does it matter now? Bifrost is captured and Mangog feeds off the hatred of Asgard's invaders. It has no weakness. Come on. Loki. What we Odin doing? created Mangog and once bound it with Skabrite chains. But Skabrite is only found on Muspelheim. Would you dare face the Infernir on their home world? I will. I must. For Asgard, for the whole of the World Tree. To Muspelheim then. And I will find you there. All right. I guess we use their equivalent of the uh, Bifrost. They will never use it again, apparently. That looked like it's just destroyed everything. Okay, so that is episode two of Thor God of Thunder as a part of my Marvel Monday series. Next week we will start uh, this new world and uh, yeah. As always guys, thank you for watching. If you have any feedback for me, please leave it in a comment below. And if you want to keep up to date with everything I'm doing, including more Thor God of Thunder as a part of my Weird Wednesday series, then please subscribe and I'll see you next time.